U.S. trade deficit widens by $46.3 billion in June Washington, AP, the U.S. Trade deficit widened in June for the first time in four months as exports fell and imports grew. Politically sensitive trade gaps with China, Mexico and Canada all increased. The Commerce Department said Friday that the deficit in goods and services, the gap between what the U.S. sells and what it buys from other countries, rose 7.3% to $46.3 billion in June from $43.2 billion in May. U.S. exports slid 0.7% to $213.8 billion, imports rose 0.6% to $260.2 billion, led by increases in medicine and crude oil. Ad Choice Advertising and Red Invented by Teeds The United States ran goods deficits in June of $33.5 billion with China, up 0.9% from May, $7.4 billion with Mexico, up 10.5%, and $2 billion with Canada, up 39.7%. Advertisement In the first half of the year, the United States has registered a trade deficit in goods and services of $291.2 billion, up 7.2% from January to June 2017. President Donald Trump campaigned on a promise to bring down the gap, which he views as a sign of economic weakness resulting from bad trade deals and abusive behavior by U.S. trading partners like China and Mexico. In a flurry of activity this year, he has slapped taxes on imported steel and aluminum and on $34 billion in Chinese products. He has threatened to dramatically increase the tariffs on China and to begin taxing imported cars, trucks and auto parts. He also is attempting to renegotiate the North American Free Trade Agreement with Canada and Mexico. But his efforts have so far failed to contain the deficit. The president promised a transformation of trade policy to bring down the deficit, said Lori Wallach, director of the left-leaning Public Citizens Global Trade Watch. Trump, she said, has not lived up to his promises, mainstream economists blame persistent U.S. Trade deficits on an economic reality that can't be changed much by trade policy, Americans spend more than they produce, and imports fill the gap. Advertisement in June, the United States posted a surplus of $22.5 billion in the trade of services such as banking and education. But that was offset by a $68.8 billion deficit in the trade of goods. By Tabula by Tabula Sponsored Links Sponsored Links Promoted Links Promoted Links You may like hip van we bet you can't spend more than $10,000 on furnishing your home hip van and Oyana Komoda Resort of view to die for, one of the reasons to visit Labuan Bajo Oyana Komoda Resort and do enjoy compare best credit cards in Singapore. Compare today, enjoy compare enjoy compare under Babel this app will have you speaking a new language in three weeks Babel under the new paper Melania backs basketball great James after Trump insults him the new paper under throne, free online game this free game will make you stay home throny, free online game undo.